one brought further refinements to the B2K option with the inclusion of another model called this Callaway Speedster. The Callaway Speedster, which was designed by Paul Deutschmann, incorporated a low cut glass that surrounds the driver and the entire cockpit, providing a striking silhouette. This particular car, which is owned by Carlisle Events partner and owner of the Miller family, uh, was commissioned for Chip Miller's 50th birthday. And Judy, Chip, and Lance Miller sat down with Reeves Calloway and picked out the colors that they wanted and apparently all unanimously agreed that this was the one to have, this combination. A couple things interesting about the Series 1 Speedsters, each one is different. This particular car, which is number 10, is a dark black metallic pearl and power red interior. Each customer would select the colors inside and out. The leather, for example, completely covers every inch of the inside, including the dashboard, door panels, behind the headrests, the seats, the seat backs, console, etc., and could be in any wild imaginative color combination that the owner chose. Under the hood for 1991, the increased 403 horsepower power plant was beneath with 575 foot-pounds of torque. Let's take a look. Visually, it looks no different than the earlier twin turbo engines that we talked about, and we discussed the feed to the Wonder Bar through the ductwork off of the Corvette factory air cleaner assembly. And you can see, again, the tune port injection manifolding, the ram's horn, which ducts the air from the intercoolers to the throttle body, and then the microfueler, which is two additional fuel injectors in front of the uh, throttle body to feed the additional fuel to feed that power. This is a car that when you drive it, I say that you're either an overdriver or an underdriver. And what I mean by that is the positioning of the windshield header is such that you either look up slightly as you drive or, as I prefer, drop slightly down. But either way, it's one heck of a ride. And if you ever have a chance to get behind the wheel or let alone a passenger in one of these cars, do it. It's a life-changing experience.